This is Crystal with Sweet Life Plans. Thank you for joining me for another video. I'm going to be doing um, a spread today in my brand new mini planner. I'm going to be using um, this brand new book that I just got this um, Friday, Wild Style, which I love. Um, if you haven't seen it, I did kind of like a quick flip through through um, my unboxing. So if you want to view that video you can go ahead and um check that out and um i'm going to be starting today i always have my extra tools just in case i have my rulers so i can cut things and also my exacto knives i showed before um they help me cut precisely as to whatever i need done and um let's go ahead and start like i said it's my brand new planner and i thought i was skipping a week but I'm not because um, actually on my last planner, I had this, the last um, the last mini planner that I had, it went up to July 4th. So I have that filled out. I'll be posting that um, in a couple of days as well. But um, I'm going to be working on this week's and kind of show you, you know, like how I put this all together. And um, I've had lots of questions on how, how I put together my my mini planner so it's kind of like I don't use it as a catch-all of course it's a mini <laughs> so I take it on the go with me it's it's small enough to like throw in my purse so um what I do is I just basically use this for like the most important things that I need done and also um things that like I cannot forget to do but I don't get too crazy with it and you know I only jot down a couple of things each day but I do use it every day so um, when I'm out and about I can just take it with me and know exactly what I need to do so first thing that um, I also need to prepare for is I do get either like um, either a thick white sheet of paper and cut it to fit this um this sheet so what i did was i went ahead and i got one of these this one actually has a sticky back so i cut it to fit and then i went ahead and i punched the holes in it with the happy planner puncher and they should match up perfectly so um the first thing i'm going to do is go ahead and get this done so that I can have it ready to go. This is always the scary part <laughs> because it's like once you stick it down, that's it. So let me go ahead and try to do it over here. And it seems that no matter No matter how much I try, <laughs> it's like it never cuts like perfectly, but it's good enough. So I went ahead and put that on there. So now I have a blank sheet. Just, you know, kind of stick it together. It's a blank sheet now. I'm going to pop that in here. See, and it goes like that, just so you can like see it ahead of time. Also, I did another little, um, sticky sticky sheet and I cut it I'm gonna place this right here so I can cover that little piece sorry I have to like stay quiet while I do this because I will mess this up <laughs> that's, that's a given okay so it's covered See how easy that is? And now we have like a whole blank sheet to design however we want, however we want to fill this out. And um, I can cover this up or leave it the same, you know, just so it's there. So today I'm going to go ahead and um, I only have a few minutes to actually record this video. So I'm going to go ahead and start popping on the stickers. <clears throat> Like I said, I, I was using the wild style. Um, I saw, of course, the leopard print from here that I'm gonna be using. 
And I also, I'm going to be using these two like coral colors. I also saw a quote that came from here. So this quote was right here. And I went ahead and I took that out. <clears throat> so my first thing I'm going to lay down on this side. I'm not going to, like I said, I'm not going to make it too crazy at all. I should probably go ahead and take that out. I just want it to look cute. I'll put it right here in the middle. And then these two leopard prints. I'm just going to try to throw them over here just so I can kind of take up space, kind of um, spread it out a little bit. Done. <laughs> you know, it doesn't have to be too crazy. I don't, like I said, I don't use this side very much, so it's good that it's nice and clean. Okay, this side I'm actually going to fill up. I have a lot of things I'm going to be doing, and um, again, I only jot down like a couple things each day on here. So I'm going to go ahead and use some of these little flags that I found in this sticker book. They have um, they were right here just so you can see. So they were on this page and I took those out. I don't like it to be like too much of the same kind of thing. So um I'm going to take the second one and put it down here so that it's kind of spaced out. Maybe I should put it here on the second one. No. I kind of like where this line is kind of coming out of it. If I can line it up right. <laughs> okay, got it. So there. Um, I also saw these little, and I may regret using them, but <laughs> because they're shiny, so of course I love them, but because the way the camera sometimes doesn't really pick it up right, it's usually safer to just stay with like the flat colors without any kind of um especially like the rose gold but you know me i gotta have that rose gold so i found them on this page there's a whole bunch of them and there's like black there's a coral and the white but because i already have the coral and black I was gonna go ahead and use these little tab, these little um, checkoffs. So I'm gonna put one here. I like to kind of like skip a line. So I put one there, and then I'm gonna put another one probably right here. Because sometimes, like if I have a lot of different things to do that I need to do, like while I'm out, I'll just write it here and go to the next line, and then skip a line and go to the next you know, agenda that I have written down. So I'm gonna put that there. And I got a couple of others. So I'm gonna do the same thing. Put one here. And put another one here. And also if you notice, I'm not being too loud today because <laughs> my husband just came in from out of town from work and he's asleep, so. I didn't want to get too loud, but I definitely wanted to record this while I'm putting it together. And I found these cute ones. I love, like all of these stickers, like if I could, i just throw them all on here. But I have to have it make sense, right? Okay. Did I pass it? I 
I know some people want to see like where I got them. So I got one from here, one from here. It's on this page. So I'm gonna stick this here. I did it on the first line on the other one, so I'm gonna have to do the same here. Just to kind of keep it cohesive. And then I loved like one of these lost pages. Look at all the rose gold. Yes. <laughs> so I got one of these stickers. Actually two because I got the circle one that's exactly like this. And then I use the beige one that's like this. And I'm going to put that together. And forgive me for taking forever for flipping through this. I don't have, I obviously it's a brand new book, so I don't know where everything's at. But um, I got it from here. So this important one, this important sticker, super cute with the animal print and it's coral. So I wanted to have that color pop. It's a little longer. Let's see. Yeah, I don't want it to cover up the letters. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to cut the bottom piece of that when I'm ready. This is my niece's birthday. I'm so excited for her party. Try to fit on here where I want as much of this heart to show. And it pains me to think about it, but I'm going to be cutting that piece off. <laughs> I don't want to like cut any of these stickers because they're so pretty. And then um, I got this other one that was on the same page. Super cute. It says, um, good things are coming. Yes, they are. And I'm going to fill this square with it. Okay. I hate to cut this sticker, y'all. Let's do it. Let me show you. I'm trying to line it up. So, okay, that looks pretty good. Get a cut. This one you have to cut pretty deep because of the thick material that it is. I wonder if I should just, I probably should just use my scissors, but I didn't have them out here. Okay, let's try this again. Please, Crystal, don't mess this up. Okay, good. <laughs> it came off. Okay, and then I have just this last piece here at the bottom. And I'm gonna cut off. I think the hardest part is like lining it up right. Because you don't wanna cut off more than what you're supposed to. Okay, let's see. Very good. Good job, Crystal. Good job. <laughs> what is this little piece sticking out? Let me cut that little piece off. Okay. Okay, so... It got cut off a little bit at the bottom and then my heart and that is going to be my weekly spread in my mini. So real quick before I end the video, I just wanted to show you that I this is actually the way my spread is going to be ending. I went ahead and I added some washi to the top and bottom and just added it a little bit in the middle. I didn't want it to be too heavy, um, but this is the, the washi that I used. It was from Live Love Posh. It was in her Happy Bundle or happy box, you know, set. And um, 
what I did was at the top of here, remember it said 2021. If you want, you can actually use a little white out. This is a little, it's almost like a tape runner. So I just whited that part out, all the little speckles and stuff. And then I went over with the washi. So this is how it's going to be actually finalized.